day and peace be with you. Today's Monday, the 15th of April 2024. It's the beginning of a working week. Let us give God all the praise and adoration that is befitting to him. Heavenly Father, forgive us for focusing on following your messengers instead of following you. Let your word be our guiding light instead of the words of others. Remind us, dear Lord Father, to open the letter you gave us and read your words so that we can know your heart. Your heart for us is to know one body, one spirit, one hope, one Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God and one Father who is over all, through all and in all. Lay us, let us, Lord Father, lay aside our own will and surrender to you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our reading for reflection today continues from the book of Leviticus, chapter 20, verses 18 to 27. And the theme given to us for reflection today is, Remember, God hates sexual sins. Let us listen to the word of the Lord. If a man has sexual relations with a woman during her monthly period, he has exposed the source of her flow, and she has also uncovered it. Both of them are to be cut off from their people. Do not have sexual relations with the sister of either your mother or your father, for that would dishonor a close relative. Both of you would be held responsible. If a man has sexual relations with his aunt, he has dishonored his uncle. They will be held responsible. They would die childless. If a man carries his brother's wife, it is an act of impurity. He has dishonored his brother. They will be childless. Keep all my decrees and laws and follow them so that the land where I am bringing you to live may not vomit you out. You must not live according to the customs of the nations. I am going to drive out before you. Because they did all these things, I abhorred them. But I said to you, you will possess their land. I will give you an inheritance, a land flowing with milk and honey. I am the Lord your God, who has set you apart from the nations. You must therefore make a distinction between clean and unclean animals, between clean and unclean birds. Do not defile yourselves by any animal or bird or anything that moves along the ground those that I have set apart as unclean for you. You are to be holy to me, because I, the Lord, am holy, and I have set you apart from the nations to be my own. A man or woman who is a medium or spiritist among you must be put to death. You are to stone them. Their blood will be on their own heads. Here ends our reading for today. Thanks be to God. Remember to share the good news with others. Do also remember to listen to the word for today by Papa Posta Ampofu. And remember, stay blessed, stay close to the word. Do not be discouraged by the challenges in life, but be encouraged by the word. Amen.